Hello, most excellent people of YouTube. Have I got another amazing jersey for you guys? How do you like this number 19, the captain's patch, the year 2000 patch, the NHL, they all wore that. The beautiful Detroit Red Wings logo, the beautiful red and white, such a classic uh, look, very simple jersey for the for these guys, got the nice white stripe, comes down and lines up nice. Just a nice simple jersey that the Detroit Red Wings went with. This player, I'm sure you already know, number 19, most amazing. Got the C for the captain's patch. The great Hall of Famer. I'm not going to let you guys see it. Okay, just kidding, I will. You got the great Steve, Stevie Iserman. How nice is that? This is an authentic, real deal, CCM, pro jersey, like they wore on the ice in the year 2000. And what's super nice about this CCM, well, in the year 2000, uh, the teams had different contracts with different companies. Some went with the CCM, which is my favorite jerseys, uh, from the 80s, 90s, and 2000s. And then like 2000, I think it was 06, 07, the Reebok 2.0 Edge from Canada took over. Well, this year they um, went to the CCM for some of the teams. Some of the teams went pro player. Some of the teams went coho. And then some of the teams went starter. But the starters, those were assembled in Indonesia. No, I'm sorry. They were assembled in El Salvador not Indonesia. I was wrong on that. El Salvador. And do you really want a jersey that's assembled in El Salvador? So I am not a, uh, a starter guy. Would not buy that. Authentic jersey for the same price of the CCM. I'll take the CCM. Once again, guys, the great Steve Eisenman, and I'm going to tell you where I got this jersey, how I got this jersey. I'm going to tell you how much I paid for it. We're going to do take this jersey off. I'm going to show you all the tags that make it an authentic on ice pro jersey like they wore back in the year 2000. And I'm going to show you all the things that make it authentic. Then we're going to do a full body view of this with different looks of how you can rock this jersey, how you can make it your own. Let's get into it, guys. All right, guys, just give you a, a close-up look that you can only get by taking this jersey off. But there's that beautiful 2000 patch that no matter what jersey they were wearing for the year 2000, they wore that for the new millennium. And then what you, this one is tagged a little bit different. Sometimes the, the CCM tag, it looks, sometimes it just has a center ice here. And then the CCM right there for the care um, tag, but here you go. Here's your CCM authentic. Then your center ice depicts that it is an on ice pro jersey, and then your CCM jersey made in Canada. And then what's really cool, you got that beautiful logo. I mean, hockey jerseys are the best for jerseys as far as I'm concerned. I have some football jerseys. I'm a Broncos guy, but uh, the, the hockey jerseys, man, those are where it's at. Then look at that Iserman, not a nameplate. Each letter is sewn on there. Uh, so nice. And with the, with the, just a little bit of an arch to it. That's how they wore them in Detroit back in the day in the year 2000. And then you always want to make sure because a lot of places will advertise CCM. They'll say authentic CCM hockey jersey, but it's not necessarily a pro on ice jersey, but yet it's a replica. So you have to look at that. And then this year, instead of the orange and black hockey shield, Detroit went to the silver and black. So that's cool there. And then always with the pro jerseys, you want to make sure you have the sewn in fight strap. If it doesn't have that, and then if you ever, some people bought these jerseys back in the day and they hated these things and they cut them off like right here. I've seen some on eBay, really cheap, but you do not want that. That You want that fight strap. That's what we all love 
to have for the authentic. And then look at the letters on here. They shine. They got a glisten to them. But yeah, guys, there's the jersey. We're going to do a full body view of it. I'm going to show you some different ways to rock this look. And then I'm going to tell you again how much I paid for it. And uh, I got a really cool super deal on this. And I'll tell you guys all about it. All right, let's get into the full view on this one. All right, guys, right out of the gate, I'm going to take you up 100 degrees past normal. But I got some really nice light color gray Jordans there for you with the red on them. Just match up perfect with this jersey. And I'm going with some Desert Storm camo pants. They call these the chocolate chips because of the black in them. But I actually bought these pants. I... I'm a guy, I like to fashion my jerseys and rock the look. And I mean, you got to wear clothes anyway when you go out. So why not take it up a notch, guys? Why not give it your best and love what you do? Love your look. It doesn't have to be a hockey jersey. I have nine authentic CCM hockey jerseys. I do not keep them all uh, where I don't wear them. Uh, I wear them on, you know, occasions when they're not going to get dirty. I don't eat with my jerseys on, no way. But, you know, just remember whatever style you have, you know, your DNA and your fingerprints are unique. Nobody in the whole world that's lived past, present, or future will ever have your DNA or your fingerprints. And you are amazing. And just remember... No one in this whole world can do you better than you can do you. So, guys, that's one look. We're going to try several different Jordans on and several different looks. So, that's coming up. Going with the super fresh look. These are Jordan SC1s. They came out from 2010 to 2014. They're the red, white, and black Chicago's. I've also got a pair of Taylor altered Wrangler jeans in the faded look. And these go really good with red. And this is a different look. You know, that camo look may not be for everyone. I truly understand that. Here's a more traditional look. But if you're going with high tops, I like high tops over low tops. I really can't stand low tops. But if you want to go with the low top look, you can just go with the regular pair of jeans and have them go over your shoes and then you're rocking that look. So you can get more looks, different looks out of uh, the high tops in my opinion. And to me, they're way more comfortable. They look better and just for practicality, I like them a lot better. But there's that Stevie Eiserman jersey. And you guys that have watched my other videos know that I don't like to go Detroit Red Wings, Detroit Red Wings with the hat. It's too much. I like to crisscross it. So, yeah, um, way too much. And then you got to go with your T-shirt here. Again, you don't want your chest hairs poking out. It's just a wrong look. Plus, you can go with, like, I went with the red one before, now going white and showing all that off. Super, super, super nice look. And then super nice look with those tapered jeans. So let's try another look totally. All right, going with another fantastic look. These are Jordan SC ones also in the white black with just a hint of red around them, but enough to really make this jersey look good. Again, going with the tapered jeans, uh, really nice with the red and the black and how that all looks. Went with the Cincinnati Reds hat, black and red. Just mostly matching up the, the colors, making it look nice, kind of bouncing them off of each other. And then again, I uh, for this look, since I'm going white and the faded, I wanted to go with the white t-shirt, but we'll go with some different color uh, t-shirts to let you see how that looks. But this is just a really fantastic uh, style choice with the hockey jersey. Um, I also have a video on my channel uh, where I do all of my Jordans on fine videos by JWB. So I have all of my Jordans on display, uh, ones you won't see here. And then you can, um, I got different ways to rock 
the Jordan look. Some of them have hockey jerseys in them, and then there's some other looks to go with that too. But yeah, let's go ahead and try on some warm-up pants and see how that looks. That's one of my favorite looks. Going with one of my favorite looks is the Adidas warm-up pants, kind of that silky feel. Got these red, black, and white Jordans. They're actually got patent leather on them. They got a little shine to them. And then just look how nice that is with the hockey jersey. Just to bring it all together. You got Iserman, you got the C. Uh, for this jersey, I wanted to tell you what I paid. It was on eBay. I had seen one just like it for 400 bucks. And it was from a vendor that, you know, has high-end stuff. This jersey was brand new. Uh, with tags. So I do, did have the tags on it. Of course, I snipped them off. If you ever want to um, wash these jerseys, turn them inside out, wash them in cold water on delicate cycle and or gentle cycle, and then go ahead and put them back the right way and hang dry them. They only take like 30 minutes to dry and they come out real nice. Just put, put these in whites that nothing's gonna bleed through. All right, let's try another look and then I'll tell you how much I paid for it. All right, going with another excellent look that I really like with hockey jerseys is going with this Jordan hoodie. Make sure your hood's down flat and then you wanna make sure that your laces, pull them out for the hoodie and you'll want them out here. See how nice that looks with that black contrasting. Then you got the hood laying flat. You got your laces out. Going with the Adidas pants. Going with the Jordans again. All of my sports hats I wear, they're all New Era 5150 fitted. And that's my style. And I get my last name on the back, Bagstad. So that's a really nice look. So this uh, jersey was $400 from another vendor, brand new with tags. Well, I just happened to go on there and look uh, probably about three weeks ago, and I saw it for um, on a bidding site, but it was a different jersey, but exactly the same as the $400 one. The starting bid was $175, and there was a little bit of shipping, and I came in at the last minute, had a reserve bid, and like with their, probably 15 seconds left, I went in and snuck in a bid uh, for the next bid up. With shipping, I got this jersey for $190. No tax, shipping, all of that included. How nice is that? A Stevie Eiserman Hall of Famer, Captain, authentic CCM jersey. If you guys do like this video, I have other hockey jerseys on display. On my channel, find videos by JWB. Let's go with another look. Gonna throw one more look at you with the hoodie. Went with the different Jordans. I had these with the jeans. I wanted you to see how nice they look with the warm up pants. Still staying with the Jordan hoodie. It's a full zip up hoodie. It's real soft and comfortable. Light, not too heavy at all. Won't get y'all hot, but if you do go to a place where you need to take it off, you can keep your t-shirt on underneath, take off your, uh, your hoodie, and then put your jersey back over the t-shirt. And then I also wanted to go with a different look on a hat. So I changed up my hat and my shoes, kept everything else the same. And uh, yeah, I'm going to go with one more look, and uh, it's going to be uh, different than you've ever seen. All right, guys, this is a look. I'm going to take you uh, to the end of my video. Got the electric green Jordans. Got the Iserman jersey. I hope you enjoyed the review. And I got the Woodland Camo U.S. Army issue. And I got the Salute to Service Broncos hat. How cool is that? Give you one more time. Hope you enjoyed this. Stevie Iserman taking you out of your comfort zone. Greens and reds match up so good together. I hope you really enjoyed this video.